Hello friends, it's me Ajit Kumar. This is PHP Tutorials. Mm. Uh, this is part 2 of um, Create a Login Page with the Database. In our previous session, uh, we did done uh, our, our project. Now, in this part 2 tutorial, I will explain this code in programs also. theme of this session. Uh, this session is uh, only for explain the code of previous session. Okay. Code and program. Okay. Now let's start. Okay. This is our database. Uh, we already created uh, that uh, in previous session login and login users is our table into the database login. Now we run our program. Okay. YouTube is a folder name and the login HTML login. This is our project. Okay. Username Ajit. Password one two three four. If username and password is in or exist in, in our database, it will show login successfully. Okay. Or otherwise, I give on a invalid or a not existing record. Okay. Wrong username. Password combination. Please re enter. Okay. Because that that is not in exist in our database. Okay. This is the HTML login dot HTML. This is our HTML code for create this page. Okay, HTML login. Okay, this is the code for create this page like this. Okay, okay. Now let now let's explain it. Okay. HTML HTML is used to open the HTML tag. And the head and body is a uh, basic component tags of uh, HTML program. Okay, this is PG color. I here, I uh, it's empty. If I give a, a red and save it, and it will be red. Okay, this is okay. Now I create a font. Font is one of the tags for uh, it has uh, attributes of uh, fonts. Okay, font. This is login. Login. Okay. Login. This login is in uh, the center of the page. So here I used uh, the tag center h1 is a heading one it's the size of this font okay here i close my font and i create a form here uh, that form action is login.php login.php is uh, this this code okay that method is post. We are using post method here. Okay. If I click login button, this action is going to login.php. That is this code. Okay. Let's go to this code. Okay. Username, password. Username. After username, uh, we include a button input as a text is a text box and the button name is uname okay username text box in this this text box name is uname okay note it and then password and the input type type is password it's uh, also a text box 
but when I click uh, when I type here this dotted uh, um, text it is used to hide our text okay this is the password attribute okay so this type is password type okay this this text box name is pass okay no tick okay after this and uh, now I created a submit button here okay we are is user to break because new line break okay uh, input type is submit submit is uh, mentioned here as a button or otherwise we use button here okay submit is user to like button view okay value is used what will be on the button if it's like that save it and run it okay so law value is used for the for this okay this button name is submit okay ah uh, wait i close this form tag and body tag html so Okay, we done this page. When I click the submit button, it will go to login on login.php. So go to login.php. Okay, login.php is a full and full PHP code. Okay, here now PHP tag starter here. Then require require is a keyword to include uh, another program here okay require sql underscore dot php sql underscore dot php is here this coding will be here okay for using require okay by using require keyword okay so now see it php tag open uh, here we connect our web page this is a web page and this is a database okay php my admin we connected uh, this one and this through this coding okay my sql connect is it is the syntax of uh, uh, connect our database okay my sql connect local host this is a host name and this is username of php my admin and this is mg uh, here is the password of php my admin if all are uh, correct it will be mm, connect or otherwise if any error will be occur here then die MySQL connection is failure. Okay. Here. Okay. This coding is used to connect our MySQL to the page. Okay. MySQL select DB. It is used to. Is this a, is this a syntax of uh, connect our database? Okay. This is connect our PHP MySQL. MySQL. This is connect our database. Our database name is login. Here the syntax oh, we give us our database name. Okay. If our database is exist, it will be run or otherwise database not exist. Does not exist. Okay. This is the mean of this code. Okay. Now after connected this it checks if is set post submit submit is the name of the button submit okay this name is here okay if i click at uh, the button submit uh, login okay these are these will be executed okay otherwise else nothing will be executed ok 
okay if we set in this index of check uh, if statement in php okay if i click the submit button this is a dollar username is a variable declaration and also dollar password is another variable declaration okay i assign this u name is used to u name is this text box name and password is this password text box name okay okay i assigned u name i assigned this name and this name this is u name this is pass okay i assigned this text and also this text to dollar username and respectively dollar password okay now here ajit here 1 2 3 4 okay if not this is a simple this is not okay if the u name u name is a this box and pass is a password text box okay if i did not the uh, um, if i will not any what I, okay if anything is an empty okay now i i give here only username not to give any password this is an empty okay so it's not stage okay now i log in you did not complete all the required fields okay. this process will be running here if i if i will give a empty anything password or username box then here echo is used to print uh, i use the javascript for uh, window alert you did not complete all the required fields it's the alert this is window alert is used to message message okay then window dot location dot sorry this is index to uh, return go to the html login dot html okay. this is this code okay if i you login with empty you did not complete all the required fields then i click okay okay this html dot html login will be done okay this is a scripting language then exit it okay now here mm, this is a this is sql is a variable declaration dollar sql is a variable declaration my sql query underscore is the syntax this is uh, our mysql query select star from login users login users is our table name okay login users this query is used to select the records these records select these records from login users where where means where username this is uh, this is uh, mentioned here uh, this okay and also username and password username and is used to this one and this one okay if username equal to username this is given text okay here the text box value is equal to and uh, the database value and also the text box value is equal to the uh, database value this is database field name okay it checks continuously 
if mysql numbers numbers it's used to check all the rows okay one by one okay uh here i give this whole query here okay for checking in loop okay if anything record is in exist as username and password or in a um, database then login successfully will be generated because zero stage uh, will not occur okay it will be one okay zero is greater than one so this code will be run if anything is exist only Login successfully, and then this is only uh, script, so don't mind it. Okay. Otherwise, if if uh, user name, our given text, our given text and field name, and also here given password, and here given password and field name. Is not a match. Else, condition will be executed. Okay. Wrong username and password combination. Please be enter. Okay. This is using uh, here. I use JavaScript. Okay. Script language. Okay. I echo in the scripting language. Okay. I hope you understood this. If you have any doubts, uh, please mail me. Uh, otherwise, uh, for more for source code, contact my blogspot website. Here is triple zero dot blogspot dot in. Okay. Thank you, friends. I hope this session was helpful to you. Thanks for watching.